We here, we vlogging. <laughs> What you nervous about, Panda? What you nervous about? Oh my god, it's so close to our house. This thing is pretty freaking impressive. This tugboat called Dr. D side ties this big barge and they have to get all the way back here. After being cooped up on our boat during the lockdown, we finally got the chance to walk around San Juan, and it did not disappoint. normal times, I'm sure this place would be full of life, but it was completely vacant and eerily quiet. We truly hope to come back and visit this colorful place again under better circumstances. Alright, so we're at McDonald's. <laughs> it's the only thing open, and why not? We could do a walk-through drive through Yeah, we asked if we can go inside, they're like, no, but we can walk through, so we're gonna order. Yeah, can I get a Big Mac? Oh. Yeah, with a Coke, a Oreo McFlurry. We right, so have to drive. Driving. Uh, <laughs> All right. So this Big Mac right here, it is delicious, and it's not like delicious that like it's the best burger you ever had. Hmm. It's just delicious because it's a Big Mac. It's like familiar, you know what it is. See, it's so good that she's stealing the sauce from it. Something about McDonald's Big Mac, so delicious. And to wash it down, a uh, tall Coca-Cola, look it's icy. You can hear the ice in there. I am grateful for this, this experience, even though it's just McDonald's. Someone else cooked it. Delicious. Having an ice cold beverage is a treat as well. Tacos and fries. I was telling Darren earlier, I don't like this underlying feeling that I'm constantly doing something wrong or I'm gonna get in trouble. <laughs> like, oh, if we're walking around for fun, standing around or going to the drive through or trying to park our dinghy. I don't know. This feels like it's just a really bad way to feel all over the place. I, the people actually have been super incredibly nice here and understanding. Um, Except for that one lady that told us to put on our mask. Like, lady, we're out in the, wait, in the wind and the breeze and the fresh air. We're not surrounded by people. Fine. I'm pretty sure the rule is just if you're in like a establishment. Yeah, yeah. And obviously around people. But yeah, if you're just like two of us walking the street, there's no one around. Yeah. No need for a mask. I think it's fine. But we're just enjoying our day. And this is our beautiful view. to drop me off in the dinghy. I'm here at the marina where I'm gonna pick up an Uber. So I got an Uber here and we're gonna head to the airport. Pick up Speedy! Woo! Everybody has to have masks. Everybody has to have masks. Yeah. 
We see Speedy. He's there. All right, you made it, dude. Made it. Here. <laughs> and Panda's gonna fall in the water. Who's gonna watch you? All right, Panda. Oh, you're gonna love it, dude. Oh my god. Everybody's calling it the uh, quarantine 15. The, the quarantine 15. I mean, we've noticed that because we're just sitting around eating. Like, yeah, we're amazing. making like big breakfast every morning. I'm so excited for your cooking. It's so good. Oh, we had the best breakfast burrito this morning. We all need to go like shopping again. Yeah, I. It felt so great to not only have someone else to talk to, but a familiar face and real friend to join us again on our journey. Christmas time! Okay. Our plugs and a flag. Yeah. Oh! There's a lot of Sharpies. Oh! Whoa. So there's oh, more, there's more, there's more. That. All these, oh, really good. all these different colors. Yeah. But wait! There's more! Oh, filters. Yes. These are filters for our dive compressor. I, I hope this will solve the problem. Yeah. 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 What? No problem. Oh, yeah. hell yeah. This uh, comes highly suggested from my whiskey guy. This is that I need to bring rum. It's from Panama. So I figured that was kind of like fitting since we couldn't yeah. get, make it to Panama. Oh, at least we can taste Panama. Yes. In Panama. Oh, thank you. Wait, did he say we aren't going to Panama? Yep, that's right. You heard it. With the pandemic lockdowns not improving, especially in the South Pacific, we decided to take a detour by sailing a lap of the North Atlantic. But first, we had to get to Maine, our longest passage yet, 1,600 nautical miles with a stop in Bermuda. So for boat Christmas, Speedy smuggled us some much needed foul weather gear and a diesel air heater for sailing the Northern latitudes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Maybe not? No. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever way you want to wear them that day. Was that rapper kid crisscross? Yeah. The, the rapper brothers? kid. <laughs> From 40 years ago. Yes. Oh, yeah, that means a lot. There we go. On the butt. Yeah. <laughs> There we go. How's it feel? I feel like I'm gonna go uh, walk on the tundra or something. What are we doing? Sailing in cold weather. A heater and jacket. This is stuff that was not on our list before. Oh. Oh. All right. Yeah. What do I look? Yay. Oh, Christmas. Okay, we are modifying the existing exhaust flange for the diesel air heater to uh, fit the new. This baby's so good at this stuff. Yep. I like your plan. Yeah, so basically uh, we're trying to cut around that taper and just, we don't, we don't want to cut too much of the taper and have it. Yeah. That's what, that's what our you know, rest against once we get cut. Look at that. Yeah, and uh, once we goop it all up. Yep. Uh, I mean, we, we're kind of putting this on rust, but it's like that, <laughs> that'll work. It's not gonna come out. Yeah. All right, so here's the exhaust. This is the outside of the boat. All right. Nice. Yeah, that looks good. Well, the install is going pretty good. We got it mostly mounted. See, we got the exhaust pipe in. Uh, it's not permanently mounted, we have to get it on the outside. But at least we got a bracket to mount this. We're just gonna do like a, a stands off here with a, a bolt that goes through the, this locker. And then last is we'll plumb up all the air lines. And very last is we have the fuel line. That's this guy right here. We need to plumb up to the fuel inlet. Overall, we're 
doing way more today than I thought we would. I thought we'd get more hung up on something, but it's looking pretty good. <laughs> Meanwhile, Panda, working on episode. Okay, this is first fire of our diesel air heater. We're just priming the system now, so the fuel filter is, you can see a red dye USA diesel in it. We have, I think I have almost all of my tools out. Yep, you do. I try not to look at it. Yep. But you gonna see this, Panda? It's, it's oh, clicking. Oh. It got fuel in line. Oh. And it's, fuel oh. has is reaching the pop. Oh. oh. Oh, you can do it. Oh. There it is. Oh. Oh. I can't let it pull all the way through there. I know, it, it's a long way. It's hot. Hot air is coming out of there. have heat for Maine, guys. Hells yeah. How amazing would that be? With Speedy's help, Panda Boat was all ready for colder climates, but it was time to do some training for the newest member of our crew. You may remember him from our first Bahamas trip. The fuel comes in yeah. and it floats up and that's the <laughs> <laughs> if you throw the top of the ocean, it free yeah. really easily. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye, man. We didn't leave the halyard here. We just tight tension in the Yeah. Hold the top. I just keep hanging down and put the through the... Oh, that's right. Come out of the... Uh, out of the clutch. Clutch. It was good. Yeah? I learned a lot. What did you learn about? Uh, popping lifts. <laughs> Cock and balls. Cock and balls. Uh, reefing. Yeah. Around. And then cross. I think I might get some arm strength in this trip. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> and raw hands. Yep. You get some nice calluses yeah. growing for Especially sure. Especially when your hands are wet. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna be like the uh, like the conservative one that's like, okay, let's just go on the reef for the third one. Like, let's just <laughs> let's, let's bring the shit down. It doesn't yeah. hurt being conservative, absolutely. With a good weather window for departure, it was time for one last provision. Reverse. No, go back to the. It's okay. It's okay. Let it hit. And then forward. This is going to be great. There we go. Yay! You made it out of the corral. Woohoo! Now go drive around a bit. Go practice. Hey, come back in now. <laughs> See ya. Oh my god. While I was busy with passage meal prep aboard Panda, I left these guys with the provisioning list. And they really did an excellent job. No walnuts. Canned chicken breast. Oh yeah. What's Ranch, this? pasta penne, you said oh. tortilla, but she wanted spinach or tomato wraps. Yes. Uh, let's see. Let me get one more thing of bread. Uh, any. Uh, do the coconut. Yeah, one thing of coconut. Graham. And everything? Yep. Yeah, that's it. All right. 
Boom. How was it? It was good. Have a good old dinghy drive? Yeah. I did. Alright. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Ready to jive. Jive, ho! Jiving. And pick up our next screen there. Yep. Man, that's a cool, cool view. How do you feel about the sails so far? I'm excited. The sea state is pretty calm and it's a fast uh, upwind sail so far. I was actually not thinking it would be like this, but it is perfect. How are you doing, Speedy? How are you doing? Pretty awesome leaving that port, huh? Yeah. Woo. Well, we are, I've left, are leaving Puerto Rico. Goodbye. Goodbye, America. Like all over your body? Yeah, all over my body. It just feels wrong when I want it to feel right. <laughs> oh, my hat's backwards. <laughs> this seems like a for a butt. Uh-huh. <laughs> it got a basic little It said that it had like a butt flap or something, and I'm like, oh, all right. It is so you can go put your butt down. Pull it down the potty. <laughs> oh, look at that. Click access. Up. Yeah. Or that. Doing man stuff. Man stuff. I guess rocks sleep really well. I know, I don't really get that saying. <laughs> It'll move. Yeah. Because she's old and flappy. Spy on the boat. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, Customs and Border Patrol boat, doing their secret mission stuff. <laughs> like, where's the ethnic food? Oh, everything is ethnic. <laughs> yeah. These plan, plan, what are they called? Plantains. Well, what are they called? Platanuteries? What? I think I just said plant neuters. Plant neuters? <laughs> Got them plant neuters? Okay, bye-bye.